little walkthrough about what you can do with WordPress and specifically what you can do with WordPress themes and functionality. My goal is to kind of show you how flexible and powerful WordPress, once it's installed on your own host, can be. So I thought I'd start off here with 2017, which is the current free theme that you get installed default when you download and install WordPress on your own host. So you can see it's got a nice full screen image header here and it scrolls down where they show you what a post looks like. You've got your sidebar here along the right hand side and then they include all the different elements and headers and how things look. Of course it looks a bit messy because they're just showing you, you know, what is possible, but this is a preview of Word. It's a full WordPress site, it's mobile responsive, it's everything you need really, but it's the very kind of basic bare bones uh, WordPress installation. So the next thing I wanted to do was show you an example of what you can do with WordPress and I thought we'd show you smartpassiveincome.com by Pat Flynn. I'm just going to refresh it here so you can see, look at this little last month's earnings graph grow there. When we scroll down we can see that it's got a, uh, a toolbar, a menu bar, navigation that follows us down the page and you can see all these graphics. Um, Pat's got podcasts and a blog and all these different functionalities, audio players and featured posts, uh, promotions for his books and the community, all this stuff built in with his own custom WordPress design that he built with his team. He's got a team of designers and coders and they test it to see what works. But it's a really wonderful example of what you can do with WordPress. It's not a fixed kind of uh, platform. You're really not limited as long as you know what plugins do all these features or if you have a coder who can develop them yourself. So the last thing I wanted to show you here in this short video is the X theme. So we saw in 2017, this is a free theme that WordPress gives you for free. It's open source, do with it what you want. But then there's also paid themes and that's an, a really great area of WordPress, this paid theme marketplace. There's thousands of them. They're not expensive, 50, 60 dollars. And then you install these WordPress themes that are built to look and function in a certain way. So X theme is interesting because it's very flexible. So if I scroll down to demos here, you can see these are all demos of things you can do with the one theme. So let's click Ethos 1. It takes us to a preview of this, this particular demo. We can see here they've got images across the top which are like featured posts. When you write a new post they appear up here. They've got a, an image slider here uh, which are also previews of posts and you can see the blog, calendar, all these different elements. But if I close that and go to let's say renew number 4 you'll see that it looks entirely different. This is like a business landing page with a learn more button. You can show featured images. Um, this would be a great landing page for like a small business company. Uh, here they're showing the number of clients they've got and the solutions. A great landing page, full screen landing page design even with you know videos. They'll have a portfolio section. It's really quite interesting what you can do with WordPress even with this one paid theme there's these sort of hundreds of different options that you can do. You can configure it all yourself, all in the back end of WordPress, and for most of it, you don't need uh, any coding experience. You just need to kind of have a bit of curiosity and to tinker around. That's what I really love about WordPress. Uh, I hope that's helped, and uh, I'll see you more around uh, Blog Tyrant.